Oh, get rid of Kim Commando. She's the devil. Please. Why is Kim Commando in Vegas? Get her out of there. Uh, you're not. Are you Clear Channel? No, CBS. Yeah, that's probably why. She syndic self syndicates, but we're on Premiere, so um, it's most likely that the Clear Channel station in town would. There's no news talk on Clear Channel. I have nothing against CBS. I'm sure we're on some CBS stations. Yeah. Yeah, you know, it's funny, for a while, um, when we first started to syndicate, Kim Commando's people really actively uh, tried to sabotage us. And um, it was kind of funny. I, I had the program director in L.A. called me up and said, you know, I just got off the phone with Kim Commando's people. They're saying, you know, that left, that Leo is left wing. You shouldn't have him on the tech guy show. He's a left wing liberal. You don't, you don't want him on your tech guy show. Uh, you should have Kim Commando. Uh, but I don't. I, I, I see no reason to go after Kim Commando. I just feel like it's not the best quality uh, advice. It's amazing that she's gone so long. Huh? Longer? Th well, I've been doing talk, tech talk radio longer than anybody. Dvorak and I started doing it in the early 90s, like 91. Um, but I feel like she's been doing it pr like 20 years. She's been doing it a long time, I think. Actually, we could find out. We could find out, I'm sure. There's somewhere. The other thing that bugs me, and she charges for her website. And it's like, you know, that's why I always say there's no charge. I don't want your email address, blah, blah, blah. Um, urgent danger of medical ID theft from Kim's desk. Keep your computer safe from the next Adobe Flash bug. <laughs> Just take it off. Look at all the ads on her pages. Wow. Super Beats. Carbonite. Super Beats. That which is not headphones, but actual beats. <laughs> I'm not kidding. They're actual nitrous nitric oxide superfood. So you'd think she'd be advertising Beats headphones, but no. She's got Harry's. She's got Commando dual lens dash cam. Hmm. Smart things. Yeah, she's got some of the many of the same advertisers. That's pretty much. Oh, it's a Google ad. You're absolutely right. That's not a. Uh... Yeah, possibly the Harry's as well. Yep. So is the Harry's. Yeah. You're right. Those are Google ads. What's on your bucket list? Get hundreds of free documentaries. Quickly find movie times. Now see. It is true that you can quickly find movie times these days. Not sure I'd do a segment on it. Digital photo frames, those are still around? Huh. Keep this boot CD handy for troubleshooting. Unless your computer doesn't have a CD drive, which most of them don't. Uh, about Kim. Let's see. America's digital goddess. <laughs> That's her tagline. You know what? I respect it because when she when she started doing it, being a, a tech report female tech reporter was a big deal. Yeah, I agree. She does it from Phoenix every Saturday morning, 450 stations, which is a lot more than ours. Estimated reach of six and a half million listeners. Yeah, I'm not sure I'd agree with that. She has worked in the computer industry since the age of 16, ultimately selling Unisys mainframes to corporate clients. In 1992, she followed a hunch. The regular consumer. So she's been doing it a, 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 about as long as I have. She began a radio career on a late night call-in show about computers uh, in Phoenix 20 years ago. The show can receive 50,000 calls an hour. I think they self-syndicate. Yeah, the West Star Network, I think, is hers. They, I'm sure they rent a transponder, but um, I don't know. No, I don't. I, I shouldn't knock her at all. I mean, uh, we're not really in competition. I'm sure the uh, affiliate relations people from uh, Premier might think that they are, but we are. But I don't think.
think we are. She can't answer 50,000 questions, no, but she gets 50,000 questions. That's clear, a very important distinction.